Hi, in this video we're going to show you the Alt-Tab replacement named Alt-Tab Terminator. So if you use Alt-Tab a lot, you might want to check this out because it kind of gives you a little more control over how the Alt-Tab works and kind of does a better job. So here's the default Alt-Tab in Windows. So you have all your apps here and you can just keep on pressing Tab and you don't really get a preview of everything there. And if you want something there, you could click on it to bring that up. And that's just you know, about all you could do with it. So, once you install this Alt-Tab Terminator, you could run it. And it should be running down here in the system tray, and it will replace the Alt-Tab feature. You could turn it off and on, actually, if you want to go back and forth. So now when you do Alt-Tab, you have this window here, and you could still toggle through your stuff there. And then you could just kind of use your mouse, too, to go through it. And it shows the live preview, like of this video as it's playing. Another cool thing, too, so let's say you have Notepad open, and you want to open another instance, you could right-click on it. You could actually close whichever thing you have open here, Minimize, Maximize, Restore, Terminate, on, or you want to run another instance, just click on this, and now you have another instance of Notepad going. So now we have the three of them down here. So now we have the untitled Notepad up here. And if you don't want it, just simply close it from this list, and it'll close the actual app itself. And another thing you'll notice, too, down here, is you have this uh, application window here. So if you want to show just notepad files, you could do that. Or if you want to show just Word files, Edge files, Excel, and so on, Chrome, which was the preview. So this Word normally does show the preview. I think maybe this add-in is causing a problem here. There we go. Then you have your settings here. Auto start with Windows. Updates replace all tab. You can turn that on and off. Uh, releasing all tabs switches to select a task. Uh, the appearance, preview or not, uh, large icons, dark, dark mode, exclusions if you want to exclude something from the hot or the uh, alt tab, set some hotkeys. You know, basic uh, settings there. And also, if you click on the bars here, you can turn the preview off and on, turn this, this is called the app cloud, turn that off and on. Uh, icon size. Uh, screen size. If you want to go full screen, you could do that too. Mouse gesture, license key, settings, take you back to here. Uh, full screen, and so on. So it's a pretty cool program. So you do have to buy it. It's a trial. I'm not sure how long it is, but it's $20 for a lifetime license, so it's pretty cheap. So if you like uh, this better than the default one that comes with Windows, you know, 20 bucks is not much to pay. So all the you know, cool stuff you could do with it. All right, so I'll put a link in the uh, description where you could download the trial and try it out for yourself. And then if you like it, you could just purchase a key and use it forever. All right, thanks for watching, and be sure to subscribe.